All right, so I got this uh, Belkin wireless in router. Uh, it's a F9K1003V as in Victor 1. Um, and I had to do a factory reset on it because it just quit working for no reason. Uh, and how I did that was uh, I held that reset button in for 10 seconds while it was powered on. So I figured I'd just show you the process of resetting it up. Um, if you get this router brand new and you don't feel like going in and logging into it and changing the settings, you can just use the network name and password right there to log in. Uh, but I like to go in and change the settings. So I'll show you how to do that here. So if you see here, I've uh, there's the network name and password, and then I went ahead and punched that into my phone. And I'll show you that it works. Come on. There you go. So it's connected. All right, so we're setting up this uh, Falcon router. Um, I went ahead and connect the modem there to that yellow hole, and it's marked modem. And then um, put an Ethernet cable in to either one of those ports below it uh, to your computer, so we can set it up. Okay, so open up, uh, I use Internet Explorer and type in 192.168.2.1 and sometimes it will autofill a stupid forward slash there. You want to make sure you hit delete so it doesn't do that. Hit enter. Because it will keep you from getting into it. So make sure it's just that IP address there. Okay, so to set up your wireless, you go over here on the left and you see wireless. Um, you can go ahead and click on that if you want. It'll ask you for a password. Um, should just be able to leave it blank, like what it says here, default equals leave blank. Hit submit. Um, change your router's name. Right here, your SSID. So you can change that there. Um, all right, so hit apply changes. It's gonna take some time. There. All right, it's finally back. Set some met, get in, click on security. Set up your password. Um, hit apply changes and wait another minute. Looks like we're finally back. Okay, so I showed you right here your channel SSID. Um, I showed you how to change your SSID, which is what you'll see when when in the wireless list. See right there it says there it is. So you got your SSID there, and then over here you can see the same SSID 
being broadcast. <clears throat> and then you set up your password here at the pre-shared key. Just type it in there and apply changes. That's that's the password to log into your wireless, not to log into the router. So to change the uh, the password for the router itself, uh, you want to scroll down. System settings, and then. Uh, System settings is down here under utilities. So you got your system settings, and then uh, oh, looks like my date and time is uh, January first, nineteen seventy. That's fantastic. Have to fix that. But uh, anyway, your your old password is uh, blank. And then go ahead and go ahead and type your new one in. Fix my time here. I should pick it up. Hit apply changes and wait another however long it takes. And then try logging in and see if your new password works. Seriously? Yay! So there, there you go.